Yo, what up, everybody? It's your boy, Cover Moses. Uh, we're going to go ahead and start off this Saturday right, baby, with a little Bowman. 2020 Bowman Baseball Hobby Half Case number 10. All right. <clears throat> I need to... Awake in the 90s. How you doing, my dude? Happy Saturday. Hope all is well. You uh, tuned in at a, at a good time. About to get a break going here. A little bomb in action. Uh, put the random up. And let's put this, uh, put this up as well. <coughs> it's all good. I mean, you can still hang out. Talk some stuff. And... Uh, <laughs> You know, just hang out. You know, that's that's free. Last time I checked. All right, we got a random the Yankees. So, good luck, everybody. Yankee Abraham. All right. Let me just copy everyone's name. Put them into the random. Let's roll the die. We're going to go 11 times. Top name wins the Yankees. Good luck. Here we go. Money shot 11. Boom. 11 times. Congratulations, Larry. You won the Yankees. There you go. Let's sort this by team name. So it's easier from my sorter. I can hear you. I hear you. You know, just just being a ninja. Nothing wrong with that. Excuse me. I was getting into the habit of pack stacking this, but uh, let's see how many people are in here. We got how many people watching? 13 people? What up, 13 peeps? I'm just going to go box by box on this. Let's see if we can... Uh, Hit some massive, massive mojo here. Raul, they have not, man. And uh, to be honest with you, uh, I'm already 
just taking that loss. First Bowman rookies, I kind of want to you know, have a little organization here. All right, what do we have here? Look at that already. I knew there was a monster lurking in this second half of the case. And there it is. I am running out of top loader, so eventually I'm going to have to squeeze these into regular top loaders. But that is a good hit right there for the Yankees. The Dominguez mojo. Bobby Witt, paper for the Royals. First box, Jason Dominguez. Yeah, don't be too, don't get too excited about it, uh, Larry. Yeah, it's, it's only the uh, the most sought after prospect. What's uh, what's that card going for, man? Where's J. Mess when you need him? I know he's out doing some uh, some Ubering. Jose Barrios to one fifty twins. See a little cracked ice back there. Sam Huff, Rangers. <laughs> There's got to be some uh, some other good stuff in this half of the case. If I remember correctly, uh, number nine, the first half, didn't have much color in it. Well, as far as autographs. So I do expect to see some color come out uh, in this second half. Jerry Collins to 150 Mariners. Logan Gilbert, Mariners to 499.
Got a little organization going here. What's up, Vintage? Want to see something nice out of this hobby, Vintage? Little Jason Dominguez. Is it really? It's working for me, Vintage. Uh, try hitting the refresh button. I just uh, I just uh, hit the refresh myself and it's good on my end. I still have another hobby case. Of uh, Bowman in the store. Probably get that breaking tonight. I have that one last case of tier one uh, that I would like to get done. We got that box of mosaic that I would like to get done. Uh, that diamond icons I would like to get done too. G money in the house. What up, G money? Ripping a little Bowman. So, anyone, uh, anyone know what that Dominguez card goes for? Twelve hundred bucks. Oh boy. Not bad, not bad. That you know, that should help pay off uh, some uh, some of that debt there. The store's working fine for me, G Money. I mean, uh, Vintage. Yep, the website's working fine for me, dude. Anybody having issues with the website? A PSA 10 for about 8K? Oh, man. I wonder how they were able to get a grading so quick. They must know somebody on the inside. Well, we still got that other hobby case. Maybe there's a red Dominguez in there or something. Has the super Dominguez been hit yet? I would have heard of it by now. I don't think it's been hit. Vladimir Guerrero Jr., 499 Blue Jays. BGS is only a week. So then, like, how come some people prefer, like, PSA, for example? Like, what's what's the difference between those grading services? Like, does one offer you, like, better service? Like, what's the deal there? Bobby Wood Jr., Royals first at the first Bowman paper. PSA is less picky, and PSA has higher prices than Beckett. Daniel Lynch, Royals, uh, cracked ice. So it sounds like BGS has a better turnaround time, which in this hobby is everything. Has it always been that way, or, or is it just because of the pandemic? 
Encarnacion of 25 Marlins. That's nice. That's real nice. The Orange Hobby Exclusive. Is that a red back there? Come on. Five of five. Cody Hosey Dodgers. I totally did not drop the card. That was just a figment of your imagination. Uh, hasn't come out yet, Raul. That's nice. Little red paper, 505, Cody Hosey Dodgers. So, is there like a difference too? Like, Ra Ra says you have a better return on your investment. So, what does that mean? Does that mean that the BGS cards, like, let's say I have, like, let me throw this at you. Like, let's say I have the exact same card, you know, and, they, and they're both in the same condition, right? And they both get the same grades. Which card would sell for more, the PSA one or the BGS one? I know that's probably a highly unlikely scenario, but you know, let me throw it at you. BGS cards will go for more. What up, Jade? PSA all the way, says Vintage. So it sounds like with PSA, you might get more dollars, but you're going to have to wait a little bit longer. And by a little bit, it looks like it's a lot longer. What is this? This is, might be the autograph. There it is. Mackenzie Gore to 30. I knew there was going to be some good stuff in this half. The first half was pretty bad there wasn't much color in the first half i think there was like one color autograph so far dominguez to 4.99 and mackenzie gore 1990 bowman to 30 autograph very nice and a red paper not a bad uh first two boxes to start off here Yeah, my boy uh, Jade is uh, having a jolly old time with all those cards that he needs to uh, <laughs> go through. <laughs> you know, I should probably start hitting up some garage sales, man. Yeah, maybe there's a holy grail out there somewhere like that Uncle Jimmy collection. Let me let me find you know a, a couple Babe Ruth autographs in pristine condition. Dude, Uncle Jimmy had six Babe Ruth autographs. I would keep the nicest one and sell the rest.
freak of nature. Nice freak, very nice, very nice. There you go, vintage. Uh, how, did you open it yet? My boy Vintage won that uh, that Bowman first edition box uh, that we were giving away in our Super Fractor Bounty many moons ago. Oh, you're just gonna okay. I thought you would I thought you were gonna open it. How much are those uh what's the retail on those things right now? Freak, somebody offered you four hundred for that color burst and what are you trying to get for it? How close is that last mosaic? Uh, let me see. It is at 26 right now. I'm pretty confident we can get that cracking tonight. Well, Freak, I wish you the best of luck. Because I for sure would have took that $400. You know, that, that would have paid at, at least for the box. A Chrome with Junior Royals. Did you win? Yeah, you did win. Uh, I thought I took care of that already. Don't let me find out you're lying to me, Jade. I know you're not capable of such things. You're good peoples. Let me uh, let me see what happens. Shame on me. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a bad boy. All right, it's in there now, Jade. It is in there now, my man. Thank you for uh, following up with me on that. I'm a terrible human being. A paper Dominguez, Yankees. Are you on your phone, Vintage? Uh... What kind of what kind of browser are you are you using? Right, Mount Castle, Orioles, Atomic, or Cracked Ice, whatever they call it these days. Yeah, I just uh, double checked the website again, and it's working fine on my end. I'm on a I'm on a PC using Google Chrome. Yeah, maybe try uh, emptying your cash and clearing your cookies. That that usually uh, helps with a lot of issues. Glenn, uh, Glenn Allen Hill Jr., 250 D-backs. My boy using that MacBook Pro. Damn, you didn't have to flex on me that hard. Sheesh. Maybe that's the problem. Uh, maybe try using Safari. Cause I know uh, I know sometimes Google Chrome is a little weird uh, on the Macs. I know this because I have a Mac. I have a Mac Mini at the crib. I love that thing.
I'm debating upgrading my phone uh, from the iPhone 7 to the 11, but I'm pretty sure they're going to come out with the uh, with the 12 soon. So I'll probably just wait for that to come out and see what that looks like. I've seen like mock-ups of it. And if it looks anything like those mock-ups, it's going to be a really cool, nice design. Another Yankee hit, Everson Pereira. Yankees autograph to two ninety nine. See, I forgot to put the Padres up there. Safari working, Chrome isn't. Yeah, that's weird. I, I don't know why that happens. That, but you know, Chrome seems to be. Uh, a little weird sometimes. Yeah, maybe it's just that time of the month when, when it starts being weird. Ah, kids play good eye, good eye. This is indeed Bowman. What gave it away? Yeah, you know, regular, uh, pri you know, private eye over there. If anyone else is having issues with the store, uh, please let me know. <laughs> That's a pretty accurate count, kids. <laughs> How are you doing uh, this fine Saturday? I guess you could say evening. It's six o'clock. I guess that's that's considered evening time. Try selling them. Are you are you selling them? Trying to sell them individually? You know, maybe try selling them as lots. Uh, Ian Anderson to 150 Braves. Some of this stuff around here. That's a little bit better.
All right. I think that might be the autograph right there. The blue card there. Let's see what we got. It's working now. That's weird, vintage. Yeah, maybe the Bowman break was too hot. And you just had to restart and cool it down for a bit, you know? Tristan Casas, Red Sox, uh, correct ice. Zach Thompson, 250 Cardinals. Colton Walker, Rockies, 499. Yep, that's the autograph. All right. Hey, dude, so far, every autograph we've pulled has been uh, numbered. And that trend will continue. To 150, Tariq Skubal, Tigers. Chris Bowen Odo. Larry says, uh, thinking Jason won't have room in their outfield for him. Kind of like what Frazier, do you think he will fade away? Well, not if he, uh, not if he has a good bat. You know, if he's out here hitting dingers, the Yankees will definitely find a spot for him. You know, my thing is, will 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 we even have a baseball season this year, or or sports at all for that matter? A Dominguez, insert refractor. The Dominguez non-auto has been, uh, the super non-auto has been pulled. But what about the super auto? Has that been pulled? Well, let's see if I can get that done. That would be insane. 
I'd probably cry if I did it. Two boxes left. <clears throat> they got five dollar foot longs, but you gotta buy two foot longs first. What the hell? drink or something after this Bowman just has that effect on me like it like hypnotizes me or something puts me to sleep Down to the last two boxes. A gold paper Mookie bets to fifty Red Sox. There might be a speckle auto in this one.
Nice. Man, not a bad break so far for the Yankees. Jason Dominguez with the cracked ice. Probably go for uh, for a little chunk of change there. Yep, there's the autograph right there. Chrome Dominguez Yankees. Any any of you guys gamers at all? Specifically on the PlayStation 4. There's this uh there's this game that came out yesterday. And I'm you know debating whether or not I should get it. It's called uh, The Last of Us Part 2. Mind you, I haven't played the first part. Uh, but I I got it. I just haven't played it yet. Miguel Vargas, the Michael in the house. Yeah, dude, it has. That's why I'm like, man, you know, I should probably beat the first game and then uh, get that set. Dude, I have so many games I haven't, like, finished or, like, even played yet. Luis Patino, 299 Padres. So Yankees and Padres doing some work. Yeah, I got Red Dead Redemption 2. Still haven't played it. Yeah, you know, I bought Fallout 4 a few years ago. Still haven't played that. And I got Devil May Cry that a friend of mine let me borrow. Like the latest one of that. Still haven't played that. I got a bunch of games I still haven't uh, touched. Yeah. And then PlayStation has this thing uh, where every month they give they give away like two free games. And more often than not, at least one of the games are, are, are a good is a good game. Uh, so there's that. Jason Dominguez Yankees paper. Red Dead better than Fallout Four. I, I, I would believe that. I only, I only, I only played like the tutorial part of Red Dead, and then I just stopped playing it. You know, real life came into uh, into effect. Like I just, I just don't play video games as much as I do, and you know, as I used to. I really just don't have the time for it. And when I do have time, it's like I just want to relax. I just want to watch like a movie or something. The one video game that I have been playing a lot, though, uh, when, I, when I do play, is Borderlands 3. I play that with my boys, and it's, uh, it's pretty fun. And I play FIFA, too, every now and then. I stop playing 2K. Cause I'm just just tired of that crap. Every year is the same old thing. But what are you uh what are you all playing right now? For my for my gamer peeps. All right, last box mojo. See what's in here.
my boys on that Knights of the Old Republic. Ah, to a certain extent, Larry. Oh, so, so Michael, you play on the PC, I assume, then? Yeah, man, I used to, uh, I knew people back in the day that would play World of Warcraft, and it would just consume their life. Ooh, an orange. Maybe an autograph? Well, that's what's cool about PCs is, you know, if you, if you can afford to, you can constantly, you know, upgrade it. Whereas with a console, you, you know, you're kind of, you're kind of at the mercy of the, uh, or I should say you're limited to the, to the hardware. You know, you can't really upgrade it. Got the last box here. I see an orange card in the middle of the stack there. Hopefully, it's an autograph. Especially for someone that hasn't had a hit. Let's see if we can make something happen for somebody. All right, last box mojo. Good luck, everybody. Especially those without a hit. <laughs> uh, vintage art, you know, I was probably playing video games back then, too. Bobby Witt Jr., Chrome Royals. Tecmo Bowl. Ah, so you were probably cheating playing with Bo Jackson all the time, huh? I'm, I'm, I may be young, but I know things. Tim Kate, Nationals, Atomic. Or Cracked Ice, whatever you want to call them. Oh man, I, I I could never I could never beat the Mike Tyson game. Punch out? Oh goodness. Andrew Vaughn to 125 White Sox. Unless I had like uh that you know I think they called it a Game Shark back in the day, where you could like uh you know get cheat codes and stuff. Dominguez Paper Yankees. And what's even crazier, if I'm not mistaken, you know, once you beat Mike Tyson, that unlocks like another, uh, like another league or something that you can fight in, where the where the where the opponents are even harder. Dominguez Yankees Chrome. 
Yeah, I used to I used to play uh, Knockout Kings on the PlayStation Two, and uh, they used to have this uh, this game on the Dreamcast too. Uh, I forget the name of it, but it was a boxing game too. The Dominguez Yankees uh, insert refractor. What up, demons? How you doing this uh, beautiful Saturday? Hope all is well, man. Thank you for uh, stopping by, saying hi. We got a little orange for Grayson Rodriguez to twenty-five. That looks really nice with the Orioles colors. Oh, dude, Twisted Metal was the sh yeah. I mean, you, if if you didn't own if you owned the PlayStation, then then you had to have played Twisted Metal at some point. Robert Poisson, eBay one of one, twenty five of twenty five for the A's. Very nice. Dude, I told you guys this man. The second half of this was. Loaded. Yeah, two of the four teams got uh, two autographs. Uh, every autograph we pulled was numbered. Which makes sense because the first half... Uh, I think there was only one numbered autograph. You know, usually in a case, you got about half. If you have 12 autographs, about five or six of them are going to be numbered. You know, on average, more or less. Your cat got on fire. Oh, I was about to say, wow, that is quite the story. I hope the cat's okay. Yeah, not bad, Michael, not bad. I don't know if you saw the uh, the other hits that came out of this. Uh, but it was a pretty good half case. So that's the break. All right, so uh, let me see here. Well, let's take out the Dominguez man since he's kind of a big deal. Well, a bunch of oranges, you got a lot of color. In this half. All right, so well, as far as with Junior of the Royals, we got two papers and three chromes. Uh, for Dominguez, just a little taste of what's to come for this guy. That sounds a little dirty, but whatever. All right, we got three papers. Two chromes and two interrefractors, along with 
the cracked ice for Dominguez Yankees. Uh, also really nice, uh, we pulled a, pa a red paper, 5 of 5 Cody Hosey Dodgers, uh, but for the autographs, because I know that's what you want to see. We got Puasone, 25 of 25 for the A's. Autograph, very nice. Luis Patino, 299 Padres. Tariq Skubal, 150 Tigers. Uh, Everson Pereira, 299 Yankees. Mackenzie Gore, to 30 Padres. And the man, the myth, the legend himself. Mr. Jason Dominguez, 499 Yankees. And that is going to do it. Uh, thank you, everybody. We'll get it out to you.